tamales of old came in all shapes and sizes. They were meat, seafood, vegetable, some were filled with corn. Tamales could be wrapped in corn husk, banana leaves, and uh, avocado leaves. Tamales were steamed, grilled, and roasted, boiled, or even fried. I love tamales. La Doña is the place to go for tamales. La Doña is one of the best tamale places here in the city of Compton. I'm driving all the way from Seal Beach just to get like six dozens of tamales. I heard about this place through one of my homies, which I live in Culver City. And what I like about this place, they make fresh tamales each day. And that's why I keep on coming. So when I walked in, you could see the assembly line. Everybody's got a little job to do. Boy, the chile verde. Open area, and you can actually see the people while they're cooking. And you can tell that everything is the assembly line is right there for you to see what they're doing. And I see the gentleman uh, peeling the fresh corn, tearing apart the husk, the leaf, which encases the tamale. Then they shred the corn. Then they put in this great big machine, and it's called molido. They smash it, and they keep on mashing it. And when it comes out, this special lady comes in with butter and sugar to make it soft. That's how they make the sweet tamales. For the other tamales, they take it out of the machine. They put the ingredients like pork or the chile verde. Once the tamales are assembled, they are steamed and finally eaten. They're great. Terrific. La Doya has been around here for like about 10 years, and she's the owner of this great place. Since I'm a connoisseur, of tamales, I'm gonna give you a little bit of history on them. First of all, tamales come from the word tamali, a language spoken by the Aztecs. Tamales have been written about since pre-Columbian days. Usually hundreds of tamales are made. It's usually a family affair, so everyone can take some home and share with families and friends and enjoy. I'm traveling to Buena Park to go visit my dad to we can eat tamales together for breakfast. This is a tradition, so get everybody in my family getting ready to eat some of these great tamales. La Doya in Compton, great tamales.